pairing the music of Arvo Pert and Carlo Nuswaldo uh, is a really interesting choice, and I was intrigued by the idea uh, when pr programming for this season's first concert. Uh, because of the stark contrast first, I was first attracted to how vastly different the experience will be for the audience when we switch back and forth between these two great composers. But then the more I started to look at it, the more I started to be attracted to the similarities uh, in a lot of ways between these two composers, albeit from two very different uh, time periods. So you have a Renaissance composer who was a rule breaker, uh, paired in this concert with Pert, who is uh, in a lot of ways a rule breaker in modern music. Um, in, in one, in, with Gisualdo, you have certain expectations of how um, harmonies will shift and resolve, and he breaks those and he shatters those expectations in ways that you never expect. Even as singers, it's a challenge to put together his music because we are so ingrained with ideas about how a line should be shaped and how a line should uh, start and climax and finish. And Gisualdo just turns that on its on its end with Parrot in this minimalist style that is um, more modern, you get a lot of similar chromaticism and dissonance that you get in Gesualdo, uh, but with uh, with modern ears, we hear some similar things that cause us to not expect what's coming next. Uh, it's oftentimes so stark and so still that we expect motion and then don't get it. And so, we get that same kind of shock to our system. So originally, the idea was to uh, find two composers that could be starkly contrasted, which it, they definitely are. The, the audience will, of course, hear uh, music that changes in, in flavor and texture and uh, emotive capacity, just starkly back and forth between these two composers. But in a lot of ways, they were the rule breakers for their time. <laughs> 